it's going to be about two to three times the cost of concrete tiles. But then at the same, in the same presentation, he says it's going to last the, the life of a roof. So concrete tiles where maybe he's suggesting 30 to 60 years, like traditional modules. Uh, but a roof can last much longer than that. So Tesla has announced these new solar roof tiles. What makes them stand out from the traditional solar panel? Well, till today, we used to build modules with multiple cells in them. He's suggesting putting one cell in every uh, tile, making beautiful solutions. He's also suggesting that he'll come out with a price point where the, the actual uh, tiles will not be more expensive than you would pay to cover a roof with tiles and the electricity that they'll produce. So very accessible and absolutely stunning results. Uh, when we have to build standard panels and try to fit them onto the roof, we end up having uh, very discontinuous solutions. With, with these solutions, you can't even tell that there's solar on the roof. So what do these tiles mean for the client? For the client, basically, when they go to build their new roof, instead of um, putting tiles on normally or trying to integrate solar, they'll just buy his tiles and it'll look exactly like a regular roof. Looking at these tiles, they don't look like the traditional big, ugly solar panels. How is this going to shake up the market? So. So this can potentially completely tra transform the market. Annually in the States, we, we, they build about four to five million homes a year. If, if he can capture that market, let's say it's a $10 billion annual roofing uh, opportunity to, to, to replace them with solar panels, and then maybe it's 20 times larger globally, we're talking about $200 billion uh, opportunity that he is trying to address. The panels are aesthetic, they're beautiful, the, the, the cells are integrated in the roof, it's fantastic. Now, should people stop buying the traditional cheap solar panels and just wait for this product to come on the market? So I would, I would hesitate to go that far. Yes, his solution is fantastic and he has multiple ideas, but we don't know when it's going to be available, we don't know at what price, it's going to be about two to three times the cost of concrete tiles, but then at the same, in the same presentation, he says it's going to last the, the life of a roof. So concrete tiles where maybe he's suggesting 30 to 60 years, like traditional modules, uh, but a roof can last much longer than that. So we don't really know what, how long these pan panels will last. Then we have to be concerned about the electrical uh, connections. Today we put 36 cells in a module, and all the electrical connection for the 36 uh, cells are within the module. If he's going to put one cell per tile, that increases the amount of electrical connections significantly, increasing the risk of failure, and on top of that, um, that, that also adds risk of fire. But I have hope that he can create something that can protect the cells well enough for it to last as long as he suggests. So are there any other challenges that these tiles may face? Absolutely. Um, when you, build a, when you build a solar panel, uh, the biggest failures are how you protect the, the actual cells. He's suggesting new technologies and he's saying that the lifespan will be even longer. It's time will tell whether or not he will have the technology to protect the cells and create this. But I have faith. Elon Musk has, uh, has a very good approach. Uh, the combination between the solar panels, the batteries that he's come out with, and the electrical vehicles, there's just so much opportunity for new business, um, for new business plans, and uh, I think that he can really shake up the market. Now these are four beautiful different styles he's developed here. Can you tell us a bit more of the style and how they actually work? So he integrates the actual cell within the, within the tile, and then um, as you can see, you, you can't even tell that there is a cell without, within the tile. And depending on, on the angle of the light, you, you can or cannot see the cell. He says that these can produce, uh, that they only lose about 2% con, uh, considering regular, in comparison to regular tiles. Meanwhile, they look beautiful and fantastic. He, he says that the first uh, set will be ready to install in, uh, on customer roofs. One of the f uh, four types will be ready to install on customer roofs uh, next summer. So I'm eager to see whether he can produce it so quickly and, and come out onto the market that fast. Well, you're right. You look at them and they just look like normal roof tiles. Yeah, absolutely. Well, thank you, Eva, for joining us in the studio and speaking about this cool idea what's coming out. Well, I, I just hope he can, he can make it happen and I, can, I hope he can create the price point that he's suggesting. That's, that's what's going to make it competitive. And, um, mm. and so far, he says he can do it and uh, only time will tell. Well, thank you for joining us in the studio. Thank you.
and thank you at home for watching. If you like this interview about Tesla, do click back because we have many more interviews like this. Goodbye for now. Thank <laughs> you.